Hey, it's Brian. Just a quick video to show you how to load film into a Nikon FM. So we're going to load a roll of Fuji 400H uh, into a Nikon FM. The instructions I'm giving you here are valid for all cameras in the FM family, including the FE, FA, and so forth. Uh, so first thing I'm going to do is take the little tab off the back of the box here, and I'm going to stick it in the back section so I remember what film I've got in the camera. Now we've got to open the back of the camera, and on the FM, you do that just like most other cameras of the air. You're going to pull up on the uh, rewind crank. However, uh, there is a safety catch on the FM series cameras. So, when I, before I can pull up on this, I need to turn this safety catch, and I've got to pull it back towards the back of the camera, like this. So, you can do it with one hand, like so. I'm going to, I have no idea if this is in focus, probably not, is that in focus, close, close enough, all right, fine, let's, let's call that close enough, all right, so I'm going to grab the, uh, the rewind crank like so, I'm going to push this catch while with my um, index finger, while with my um, thumb and my middle finger, I'm going to pull up on the, um, on the rewind. Uh, knob. So open the catch here, pull open the rewind knob, bingo. All right, now the camera is open. Put that back here and refocus. Is that right? That's about right. Close enough. I think you can see well enough. All right, so now take the film out of the thing. Um, first thing I want to do is get this out of the way. Just push that up or pull, no, actually, I'll take that back. No, no, here we go. Yeah, pull it up out of the way. Um, and yeah, I can pull that up out of the way and I've got to, um, to push in the, um, the safety catch, pull this up out of the way so that I can insert the cartridge into this little section here. Okay. Now, once I've got the film cartridge in there, I'm going to put the rewind knob back down so it catches. Now, over here on this side, I want to take the, uh, there's a little, the, the, the bottom of the take-up spool has some serrated edges so that I can turn it like so. And you can see the um, slits in the take-up spool that way. So, I'm going to pull some film like so, find a slit insert the film into the take-up spool like so, turn the take-up spool, make sure that it's got, here we go, make sure it's in, all right, now I'm going to turn the take-up, the, the uh, rewind knob very slowly and gently, I'm going to turn it clockwise just until I feel the tension and the reason, this, this step was kind of optional, but the reason I'm doing this is so that when I advance the film here, this rotates. So, and I can see it rotate, which confirms that the film has been properly loaded. So in order for that to happen, there can't be any slack in the cartridge. So I'm going to take up the slack slowly, gently. And now, uh, here we go, see. Now I'm turning on the rewind knob, and you can see the film moving here. So I know that, the, that there's no slack in the cartridge. Uh, the... Uh, leader, the, the, the film leader is securely in the take-up spool. Now I'm going to close the back of the camera like so. There we go. And all right, film's already released, or the shutter's already released, and we advance. And I'm going to advance. There we go. All right. Film is loaded. That's all there is to it. Okay. Hope this was useful. Take care. See you next time. Bye-bye.